This guy I'm about to play has 1,500 wins and only like 60 losses or some shit. Pretty ridiculous. But his connection up to me is terrible. It says that he only has a yellow connection, so the match will probably be terrible. Let's see if he's learned stuff with Tanya that I haven't, or vice versa. Fight. What the hell is that? I do not think he played with freaking Tanya that much. <laughs> Round two. Fight. Nope. Oh, here we go. Didn't actually earn any of it. My move just didn't come out. Good move. Oh, move didn't come out again. Damn trade. That was a bad, uh, a bad start to the match for me. Uppercut doesn't come out. Well, I right, look at this combo. He doesn't earn. Didn't do that. Well, unearned. Couldn't block low. I tried. Oh, it moved and come out. Here we go, I'm done, it's over. I didn't <laughs> I couldn't even move, you saw that, right? He did full screen for overhead, my character didn't even react. Didn't block or move at all, just stood there. Well, he has a he's pretty good with the teleport combos, which I don't know how to do yet. So obviously he's been watching someone doing teleport combos, which is good. It just sucks that that match I couldn't fucking block anything, as usual. As fucking usual, but that's online play. It's a piece of shit. I have the better fundamentals. I have better reactionary gameplay. That guy has complete pattern gameplay that works online, and he wins because online pattern gameplay works, and reactionary gameplay is shit because it delays and doesn't actually work. But overall, what do I think of Tanya? I think she's a great character. The fact that she has high-low game with special moves as well as combos, the fact that she has high combo ability, I get the feeling that with those teleports... If used it properly, you could probably do some really great juggles and combos, uh, you know, that you would need to practice in order to do. Uh, but uh, she seems good. She, I'm telling you this, her versus Jason, she seems tons better than Jason. Jason to me just seemed like a silly gimmick versus Tanya seems like an actual viable MK character. You know what I mean? Like, she seems like she belongs in the game. Jason was just kind of like, let's throw things in there, kind of like a Jason movie monster, but it doesn't, it wasn't really viable, besides one little high-low thing that he had with his slasher variation. But, uh, but pretty good. Good, you know, good character. I like Tanya, and, uh, definitely, a, if you're gonna, if you're looking for DLC characters that are viable, she's definitely gonna be one of them, in my opinion, uh, you know, from what I've seen today. But, that's it for my initial first gameplay with Tanya. And I hope that you enjoyed it, even though, as usual, there was plenty of lag present. Hopefully you had fun with it. And uh, thanks for watching.